Hi guys, what's up? I am ashy. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. So let's not drink coffee for a week, you know? Let me explain to you what is happening. So I have a serious, serious addiction to caffeine. Like any form of caffeine, it can be energy drinks, coffee, anything, anything caffeine related. I have a problem with it. And I really want to start drinking less of it, but considering I honestly drink one coffee and one or two Monster Energies a day. One or two, not two, not, not always two. Only when I need it, you know. So today, let me show you what I will be drinking all week. Water is going to be my drink choice because if I drink anything else, I don't think that's going to be good. So let's take our first sip of water today if I could somehow hold the bottle up that would be nice let's go basically how this is gonna go I'm going to do little updates every morning or if I'm struggling at some point during the day of course I'll give you a recap at the end of each day and let you know how everything went how I'm feeling my energy everything and that also means if I order food I have to get water which is gonna happen because my lift is one minute away and I have no time to eat so that's I was supposed to get up at 7.30. I may or may not have kept sleeping, but we're not gonna talk about that. I'm gonna just shut up and I'm gonna go to work and I will update you guys if something crazy happens or my- I don't know, my body starts to break down. Okay, bye. Hi again. I'm back. I'm gonna just kinda update you on how my first day with no coffee has went so far. This is my water from this morning. I try not to drink too much water, but enough to stay hydrated because I don't wanna have to go to the bathroom every five seconds because I'm a lifeguard. We all know this. But yeah, besides the fact that I have a really, really, really bad right now i'm fine but i think my headache came from yelling at kids all day yeah i can't really tell i'm not a normal person honestly i haven't really been in such a great mood today i've been really down i'm not gonna lie to you i've been really down and out and like not happy is it because of coffee who knows i'm gonna finish this water for the day probably have some more water later it's only like three o'clock so yeah i will see you guys tomorrow for the next day of having zero caffeine for a week. I feel like the air conditioner is really loud for you guys, but it's okay. I'm hot, so oh well. Good morning and welcome to day two of not drinking caffeine for a week. Hi, I'm at work right now. Um, hello. Welcome to day two. I started filming this intro and then I had to switch my memory cards because I ran out of space. Yeah. Welcome to day two. My beverage of choice today. Smart water. And I have a acai flavored vitamin water, which is my favorite. Acai sponsor me, please. I love you. Wait, did I say a sorry? Vitamin water, sponsor me. Today is going to be the real test because I work a full day today. And by full day, I mean I work 9 to 3, 3.30 to 8 p.m. With no caffeine, I don't know how I'm gonna be acting by 3.30, let alone until 8. So I'm gonna have to keep you guys updated. But it is supposed to rain a little bit later on around my second shift of work later on. Um, Not here, but at my other job. It's complicated. I have multiple jobs because I... It's so hot. Oh my god, why is it so hot in here? Actually, I will see you guys when I'm at my second job. Then we'll check in to see how I'm doing for half of the day. Because I don't know how this is going to go. I did take a vitamin B12 this morning. There's no caffeine or anything. B12 helps you like boost your energy naturally. Anyways, I will see you guys at 3.30 when I get to my second job. Bye. <laughs> Oh my god, I can't hear. I just want y'all to know that this, this is the funniest song I've heard. And it's crazy that like some people are really singing that seriously. But it's fun to listen to. And Shut up! Pity, I'm sorry, I'm gonna yell at you. Anyways, hey guys. Ew, I look like I just rolled out of bed, but it's okay. Welcome to day three. I may look tired, but I'm actually not, surprisingly. I'm about to eat some bacon. But yeah, welcome to day three. Oh my goodness, here we go. You already know what the bev of the day is. You already know the drill. I'll update you guys later. I actually don't have a full day today, which I'm kind of 
kind of happy about like go off girl that means i absolutely have to edit today i actually have to send off some pictures today because i didn't finish editing those and i have the whole oh my god i have so much to do yeah and my eye eyelash extension i almost said eyebrow extension oh my god my eyelash extension appointment might actually get moved to today shout out to iced out beauty on instagram if you don't know now you know if you are in the new jersey or what is what's cool is it lincoln university area definitely hit her up depending on when this video goes up depends on where she's gonna be i will keep you guys posted i need to eat and then go to work i will see you guys later that was corny. Who really needs pants? You know what I'm saying? Like clothes are so unnecessary. Taking my knee brace off because um I've been a literally broken boosh in more ways than one, you know? Let's just spill the tea on how my day went, you know? <laughs> Oh, by the way, this is how far I've gotten in my water today. Just about, kind of, not really halfway there, but almost. So my day, as you guys saw, started off pretty good, normal, you know? Normal people stuff. Nothing crazy, nothing bad. I got to work, and... Uh, uh, it all went downhill from there. It just didn't get anything better. I don't know how I didn't realize this, but I chose to start this challenge on the day I started my period. Um, uh, so I have a migraine right now. It, I, it, uh, mm. I was fine until I talked to my supervisor. I mean, just had the slightest interaction with my supervisor. For some reason, he pissed me off and it just hasn't been good since. On the bright side, my eyelash appointment did get moved to today at like 5.30 or 6. It was fine until lunch. Now, usually, if I'm not bringing lunch, then like the group of kids that come for the Y before lunch, before they get there, I'll order my food. Right. That's what I did. I got Kidoba. I love Kidoba. I ordered it to be here at 12.30, which is when my break begins. 12.30 comes. I'm like, you know, I know it's not going to be super on time. 12.40 comes. All right. Why the f aren't you even at the restaurant yet? 12.50 comes. I am f***ing livid at this point because first of all, now I don't even have a full break. I've been sitting here waiting for my Kidoba since 12.30. Not even that, because they left earlier. Since like 12.50. What? 12.50? What? 12.25 is what I meant. And the thing is, like, on my phone, I'm literally, like, I keep checking the DoorDash app, right? Now, they didn't confirm my order at Kadoba until, like, 12.35, maybe-ish, 12.40. Wasn't mad at it, you know? So, I'm looking at it on my phone, and you know how on Door- I'll, I'll literally show you right now. You see how you can see where the car is and how far it is from the store? Yeah. Let, let, me, let, me, let me give you an example where the freaking car was. The store was right here, right? The car was down the street. It stayed down the street for at least 20 minutes, then just slightly moved up the street by like a half a block, then stayed there for like another 10 minutes. Just thinking about it just makes my headache worse. Oh my God. So it's one o'clock at this point. I have until 1.15. I know like how how far that Kadoba is to where I am. I know it's not gonna take five seconds to get there. And I canceled my order and complained. They gave me a full refund. Do I deserve coupons and extra money? Yes, because you just wasted my entire break and now I have literally nothing to eat. So after that, there were only two groups left for the rest of my day like halfway through that first group it started pouring down rain like pouring down thunder lightning everything the whole shebang right the next group comes it's still raining just as much as it was when the other group was there then my supervisor tells them that they can't get in the pool because it's thundering and lightning if that was the case these should have got out a long time ago and I could have been home I've been surviving off of this water and then I get to the point where if I haven't eaten at least water is not gonna help me baby Only thing that can help me is something of substance like coffee See that's why I get through such long days without eating is because I have Coffee now surprisingly I haven't had any like temptations or anything to have coffee or caffeine in general I haven't really had any like serious temptations. The only thing that has been bothering me is just my migraines that just kind of Thanks, Thunder. My migraines, I just kind of go on and off from time to time. But other than that, I've been really pretty okay. So that was my 13 minute spiel about my day. But I'll see you guys tomorrow for day four. Almost forgot what day we're on. Day four. Four, 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 four. Hi, guys. <laughs>
Welcome to day four. It is 8.16 in the morning. I literally have to leave in four minutes to go to work. I love that for me. I think I'll take a B12. This is what I was talking about from the first day, I believe I mentioned it before. I took a vitamin B12, which is supposed to naturally help you with energy and your metabolism and uh... Oh! Yesterday, right, I got my eyelashes done. I'm so sorry. I completely forgot. Shout out to my girl Osa for doing my eyelashes. I kind of love them. I kind of love them. First of all, who are you trying to impress? Stop. Stop. Ain't nobody looking at you. The fuck? So yeah, this is really quick because I literally have, what, three minutes now? Two minutes now. All right, so I will see you guys later. Yeah, I'll just see you guys later. I have a half a day today. It's This is very weird for me to actually have like not a full day where I'm breaking my back going to every single job in the fucking world until 8 o'clock at night but I'm not mad at it but I'm mad at it I'm not mad at it because I've literally been exhausted which is why I drink so much coffee because like I'll be exhausted from working a full day one day and then I have to get up early as in the morning the very next day to do it all over again and then I have one half a day I still have to get up early as go to work for that half a day and then come home and then I have no energy to do anything like that's why it's been taking me so long to edit because I've just been extra exhausted but I need to like I know a lot of people say like oh you can sleep when you're dead you're young but like no seriously I'll sleep when I'm dead there's too much that I want to do to just sit here and there's way too much I want to do in life to just sit here and have a half a day off like from three o'clock on and I'm just off and not do anything like yesterday I'm not gonna lie to you I came home ordered Wendy's and got on the game and then I was editing pictures and then got back on the game like I have a problem with procrastinating and I always have when I know it's something that's gonna take me a very long time to intricately do from beginning to end I procrastinate the most like editing I know it's gonna take me a lot of time from beginning to end speaking of which comment down below if you want me to do a how I edit my videos video because a lot of people ask like how I edit my videos and like what do I use and like I don't I don't I don't know how do you create your magic because <laughs> I know I'm a famous youtuber but anyways I have zero minutes and I have to go so I will see you guys when I get off of work goodbye we popped out at your party I'm with the gang and it's gonna be a robbery so tuck your chain I'm a killer girl I'm sorry all right all right let's talk super super quickly so I figured I'm wearing the same shirt as yesterday I just threw it on because I'm about to clean my room but I just figured it all out so basically I think the reason why I've been getting like serious migraines number one is because the pool area is no longer air conditioned and there's no fan so it's extra hot and then the extra hot just makes the smell of the chlorine more intense especially when I'm dealing with a lot of sick kids like I just got better from being sick like a week ago all of that combined is not good also I realized it's also because I usually don't eat a lot at all like I don't snack I just eat my two meals basically a day and keep pushing because I have coffee to like kind of fill me up during the day but I can't really do that as much like yes water is really good and it will really fill me up enough but I still need to like eat stuff <laughs> I almost went migraine less but of course you know combination of me yelling at children and you know the chlorine literally being in that pool area makes my eyes burn like by three o'clock it hurts so bad to keep my eyes open I'm not gonna lie to you yeah I kind of figured out the science behind it all which was kind of common sense but for me it's very normal for me to not eat at all or snack or anything my lips are so dry what the freak and I'm really excited now to continue the rest of my weekend I don't have anything planned thus far for Saturday um which is good I have work all day tomorrow right now I have to edit a whole bunch of pictures so yeah cleaning my room editing tomorrow i'll be working all day hopefully editing in between when i have breaks which is probably never and hopefully all saturday editing so i can just get everything done and out and monday is my last day of this challenge but we'll see if it's really gonna be my last day i don't know yet so i'll let you guys know and i will see you tomorrow for day five hello welcome to day five right now i'm just finishing this water i have right here really not a lot and then i have a overfilled water that's scared you see that right there that just scared the 
out of me. So yeah, I'm just waiting for my lift. Um, I have a full day today. Yeah, that's really it. I actually ate breakfast, you know, being a healthy human being, you know, actually eating something in the morning. That's nice. Actually, I think I am going to take a beach ball today. I have no clue if it actually is doing something, but... Well, freaking sweet. Yay. I love taking drugs. I just want to disclaim that that was a joke. I don't love taking drugs. That was not to be taken... Literally, okay? But I have to go now because my lift is literally around the corner. So I will see you guys probably when I get off my first job and then I'll check in later. Bye. Hi. I haven't talked to you guys in like a day and some change, I think, because I don't remember. I did. I definitely did it. So the last time you guys saw me was Friday morning. How did Friday? Friday actually went fine. Work was really good. Okay, not morning work, but after that because I came here and Rose was working today. I mean, not today, but Friday. You know what I mean. Rose was working on Friday and she just made my day. We ordered pizza and everything. We had a whole pizza party, you know what I mean? The only bad side about the day was the fact that it literally was like, is that like a spider web right there? It rained for like three seconds on Friday and then just Stop. poured down hurricane type rain and just stop like okay go off or whatever and then saturday morning literally my mom offered me coffee and i sadly had to decline the offer of coffee but it wasn't actually as sad as i thought it was gonna be because i genuinely don't want coffee like i don't have a craving for it i feel like it's more of a treat because the more i drink so much water and not have a lot of sugar in my like diet because i already don't have a lot of sugar unless it's on occasion like this morning i had a crumb cake water is just the wave like water was already the wave now it's just the wave you know what i'm saying so yeah saturday i basically did nothing but talk to my friend eric on facetime while he got drunk and then his phone kept dying so i had my own party in my room but it was more of a i'm not getting drunk i mean i may have had a sangria or two it was a cleaning my room by myself party yeah it was a cleaning my room party which i didn't even finish because my room is still a mess uh and my mom's calling me oh my god oh my god and i have to open the phone so i will talk to you guys later so I never actually gave an update after that or did an outro, so yeah. But Monday, I decided to try my first coffee since this challenge began. So here's that reaction via Snapchat cam. Very anticlimactic because it tasted the same. I don't know what the f*** I expected it to taste like, but I did it. The next day, I tried my favorite brand of crack. You guessed it, Monster Energy, aka The Real Crack. No, I did not record it, yet I let my dear friend Eric watch my crackhead reaction. But all in all, after this little experiment, I stopped drinking caffeine because I realized- You stupid. <laughs> Wow, I could never. But I don't drink as much crack as I used to. I never expected this week to actually change me wanting coffee, so in my eyes it went well. So I won't bore you with this lovely text and beautiful voiceover any longer. I hope you guys liked it, and if you did, give this video a thumbs up and share it with everyone you know. Okay, bye. Love you guys.